After Pakistan government announced the banning of Indian films from its cinemas across the nation, members of the Indian film fraternity say it doesn't make any difference to India and that it is Pakistan's loss. For those, Ashik Awan, special assistant to Prime Minister Imran Khan on information and broadcasting, claimed this action was in retaliation to India's abrogation of the Constitution's Article 370 which gave special status to the state of Jammu and Kashmir and allowed it to have a separate constitution, a state flag and autonomy over the internal administration. Reacting to Pakistan's decision, filmmaker Ashok Pandit, chief advisor of the Federation of Western India Cine Employees, told Anis, It doesn't make any difference whether Pakistanis watch our films or not. I think the eternal security of the country comes first, whether films released there or not is irrelevant. We have a clear issue in front of us. Our film industry is very big. Even business-wise, it doesn't matter. We are taking about our country. However, trade analyst Komal Nahata told INS, Pakistan had become a hot territory, especially for big films with big star cast. Indian films did depend upon Pakistan for a fairly good amount of overseas business, especially for stars like Salman Khan, Shah Rukh Khan and Amir Khan. Their films used to do very well there said Nahata. He stressed the ban will lead to piracy in Pakistan. There will be piracy. It's not that people will not watch our films. It's just that officially the money will not come to India. Pirates will make hay while the sun shine. Bollywood actor Sonu Sood told INS, Pakistan banning Indian film is their laws, not ours. But Article 370 is the best thing that could have happened in the last 72 years. National award-winning filmmaker Madhur Bhandarkar whose film Calendar Girls was banned in Pakistan, told Anis. Firstly, I'm not surprised because they already severed many other bilateral relationships. I'm not surprised because they have to take a grand standing in front of their people because Article 370 has been abolished. The film industry has shown solidarity since Pulwama. In recent times, Pakistan has banned various Hindi films owing to different reasons. While Razi, Ayari and Parmanu, the story of Pokhran are among films to have been banned owing to what Pakistan felt was politically objectionable content. Mulku was banned because the country's censor board felt the film's portrayal of Muslims in India was not right. Badman, Viri the Wedding and Pari have been among other films refused to release in Pakistan even at normal times. Besides films, every other Indian culture content has also been banned from Pakistan. Subscribe to our channel, just click on the bell icon for all the latest updates.